lactose intolerant, then it's not for you, but... Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Today, I'm going to review this snack I'm about to finish. It's Moon Cheese Gouda flavor. It's one of the best snacks I ever had. If you're lactose intolerant, I do not recommend buying the snack, but since I'm not, I like to surround myself with snacks that is high in protein, high in fat, which causes me not to overeat and makes me satiated throughout the whole day. I want to show you guys how to read you know, the nutrition labels and the ingredients. So let's get right to it in the front. It says moon cheese crunchy cheese snack and has some French wording because I'm in Canada. This is Gouda flavor, crunchy bites of tangy bonus. And this whole bag uh, from Costco. And just a friendly reminder, I always buy in bulk, buy in sale. And I'm a Costco member, so I usually buy a lot of my food and snacks from there. Now on the back, this is moon cheese Gouda. Holy freaking delish, this bag is full of crunchy Gouda bites that are so darn Gouda and Gouda for you. Uh, good luck eating just a couple. So it has 19 grams of protein, 46% daily value of calcium that's per serving. And it's from Nutri Dry Food Company LLC, Ferndale, Washington. And it's a product of USA and it's certified gluten free from Canadian Celiac Association. So let's read the ingredients first. Pretty simple Gouda cheese, then parentheses, pasteurized milk, salt, bacterial culture, microbial enzyme, which is basically one ingredient. So and it's readable, so you can tell it's a pretty decent quality product. So nutrition facts, this is per two thirds cup, 50 grams, calories 310, that's pretty high. So fat is 25 grams, saturated fat is 16 grams, and trans fat is 0.3 grams. And carbohydrates, there's about two grams, fiber is zero, sugar is zero, protein is 19 grams, Cholesterol 70 milligrams, sodium 690, and there's potassium 50 milligrams, calcium 600 milligrams, obviously high in calcium, and iron 0.3 milligrams. So all you need to know that it's high in fat and it's high in protein, so it's not a low calorie food, but just for tote bag, it's actually 1,426. I'll probably have the link to my spreadsheet. So, but even though it's a high calorie food, I bought this back probably back in January or February and now during this time of the recording, it's May 1st. I had this snack for a couple months now and I usually just grab a couple bites or I use that garnish and I'm pretty much satisfied. I don't overindulge snacks that are high in protein, high in fat, versus snacks that is high in carbs and sugar. It doesn't trigger my hunger hormones. The tricks is try not to buy snacks around the house or your place, but we live in a real world, so every time when I buy snacks, I usually get snacks that's high in protein and high in fat, which doesn't make me want to crave more after a couple bites. Now, this snack is cheese, so you're lactose intolerant, then it's not for you. But for me personally, I love cheese and I can tolerate it and I don't get any adverse uh, reaction, none so ever that I know of. It's one of the few tricks that stay lean and healthy throughout the year. Now, if you like this product, I suggest buy Costco size bag, which is where I got it from, or you can go to mooncheese.com and they have different flavors. And that's all to it. Remember guys, it's calories in, calories out. The more calories you consume, you will gain weight. The calories you burn below your maintenance calorie, you will lose weight. One of the tricks is you don't have to start yourself. You just got to surround with the right type of foods and you will gradually 
lose weight and you'll stay lean throughout the year. So if you like this short video guys, please give it a thumbs up, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, and motivate me to produce more videos. Today is a nice sunny day and after this, I'll be going outside and just get some vitamin D, get some sun, and hope you guys have a great weekend.